We're here at Big Bass Campground, Ocala National Forest. is that way now let's get on to the campsite after you pull in you keep to your right and get moving there's a big trash can here but it looks like people dumped their normal trash like someone dumped a futon There's trash bins scattered around this whole place. Not washing allowed. I mean, they don't want you to wash stuff there, but you can use that water to wash your stuff. All right, that's the only thing I would think I would use it for. Coming up on campsite one, I think. Yes. This is campsite one. Picnic table, barbecue thing, and fire pit. And there's my campsite. Sorry about that. Campsite two. Got good sun, not much shade. There is some shaded spots. And we're coming up on campsite three.
they all have pretty much the same thing that little pole to hang stuff picnic table fire pit and barbecue grill whatever this is four and that's five right there That's campsite six. One of the two vault toilets. And here's site, well, I guess there's 19 sites. Nineteen is stuffed out in the corner. I don't know why they did that. They should have changed that to oh I forget what number I just said. You walk down that ways, you'll get to more of the swamp land that probably used to be a lake. Oh. Upcoming spot there. This one actually has a concrete slab. And it still looks like someone's reserving it. That's seven. Some more trash bins. They're scattered out through here. Site 10. This one has a more protected water source. Take water to camp. So yeah, they don't want you to just wash your dishes there. Whatever. Okay, these numbers don't seem right because I thought I just saw nine back there. But site nine. This one has two poles. That would be nice. Hang up. If you had to hang up and do some clothes, laundry. Site 10, as you see, these sites go from different sizes. Some seem huge, some seem 
standard, I guess. Coming up on site 11, it's also a pretty decent site. What you consider as part of the site. Eleven. This is twelve. There's another one of those little billboards of different. Fourteen. Or no, that's twelve. That's probably four. Well, that is fourteen. 13 and as you can see you can see a little bit of water fifteen has a concrete slab so yeah if you have a good size RV either one that one or the other one. Site 16. It looks like it's reserved, but that's a national forest person. I don't know, see, I like my spot, but there's not much shade, but I don't want too much shade because I don't want to run out of power. Seventeen. In sight, eighteen. So there's 19 campsites in this. So hopefully you're enjoying the tour. We're gonna get back there and start cooking maybe some tacos for lunch. Okay, we're gonna be making some tacos. There's the hamburger. Some sausage meat. I'll get this thing cooking and we'll get it started. I'm gonna be at some seasoning. And after that cook for a while, we'll actually add the taco seasoning. So let this cook for a bit and we'll be back. Okay, the taco's done. Uh, sorry about you didn't get to see me putting the seasoning on it. The taco seasoning. I just overheated. There that is. Give me a minute and I'll put the cheese and put my taco blend cheese on it. Now we're gonna put some hot sauce. Good. So 
gonna get sit back just relaxing hopefully you enjoy this content and see you tomorrow for another maybe meal probably hamburgers since all i got is hamburger meat and uh, maybe not i'll go to this i have to leave here tomorrow go to the store and get something else